here with Lisa Donovan, the pastry chef of Husk Restaurant. We're gonna make one of my favorite things to eat, buttermilk pie. Buttermilk pie. So really all you're trying to do is get it nice and tight in there. And then you just trim your overhang. Nobody loves to trim the overhang, but you just gotta do it sometimes. The next step is to crimp it. We have this tradition of chess pies and transparent pies and shoe fly pies and buttermilk pies that you make when there's not an abundance of fruit or you're out of preserves. I love them all. Every pie crust needs to go in the refrigerator. So while you're making your filling, you want to get your pie crust cold. So we'll do our eggs, all the sugar. favorite thing about sugar pies is it's just a one bowl deal. Yeah, it's easy to make, but if you don't have good buttermilk or you don't have good eggs. That's right. If you don't have a good pie crust, you're wasting your time. So that was flour and a little bit of salt. Oh, butter. And that's it. It's that simple. Bake it 375. How do you know when it's done? Your middle will be set, but still a bit jiggly. And I have lots of references to what kind of jiggle. Right, I was about to ask, what kind of, <laughs> kind of jiggle are we talking about? Are we talking about the jiggle that I saw at Donks the other day? Or? <laughs> yes. <laughs> so it's all cooled off. Now we can eat some pie. Awesome. I love the top, how it gets mm. crunchy. It's the best part. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Perfectly set up. Look at that jiggle. Look at that jiggle. Oh. Uh, Sir Mix a Lot would love this pie. <laughs> there we go. Mm. My favorite, favorite sugar pie. Awesome. Ever. <laughs>